Hello guys, today we are going to print prime factors in C++ from van to n. So let's review the basic definition of prime factors. In number three, the prime factors of a positive integers are the prime numbers that divide that integer exactly. The prime factorization of a positive integer is a list of integers prime factor together with their multiple sides. And the process of determining this factor is called integer factorization. I think so, with the example, we would be more clear about the concept. For example, let's take the number 36. The factors of number 36 are 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 9, 12, and 18. But from all these numbers, only 2 and 3 are prime numbers. Uh, and also keep this thing in mind, and all the prime factors, when multiplied, would be equal to the uh, dividend, okay? Uh, so it could be a proof. Now let's move towards our visual studio. First of all, we will write loop. Okay, first of all, we will ask uh, our user to enter value. And also initialize this value to remove the error. Okay. We should start this value, initialize this value with 2 because uh, we are also about to find prime numbers with the factor. Okay. So set the limit as the user said and use a loop and find modulus because uh, in the factor we have to find the modulus. We will also write on this program to be more clear. Okay. Uh, I think so we are done with this program. It's quite small. For example, if we enter 36, we'll get 2, 2, 3, 3. Okay, now let's write on this value. Uh, 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 okay. Um, when i is equal to 2 and we enter number 36, loop will run from here. Number modulus 36 is equal to 0. This would be true and i would be printed. Uh, uh, which would be 2. And uh, then 36 divided by 2. Number is 36 and uh, i is 2. So it again would be multiplied and again condition would be uh, would be proved true and again I would be printed now a uh, number would become as 9 and 9 modulus 2 is obviously would not be equal to 0 so the condition would break and I would increase here and now I is 3 and number is 9 9 modulus 3 is equal to is equal to 0 the condition would be true and we will print I which is 3 Again, 9 modulus 3 is obviously result will be 3. Uh, num and then the number would be, number variable would be incremented or value would be changed. Again, 3 modulus 3 is equal to 0, obviously. And uh, I would be printed again. And 3 modulus 3 would be equal to 0. Now, number would be uh, incremented and the number now come as 0. So, condition would break here. And uh, result, obviously, would be 2, 2, 3, 3. As uh, maybe I am quite fast, I will try to be no better in the next tutorial. Uh, okay, in the end, uh, if you like my tutorial, don't forget to subscribe my channel. And uh, obviously, you can also download the C++ Android programming quiz application from the Google Play Store. Uh, links of both apps would be in the comments. And the second app is the Core Java Quiz uh, to test your knowledge of Java. Uh, I hope that uh, you liked my tutorial. Thank you very much.